Hey guys, what's up? Andy Fogarty from theathomewelder.com. I'm here for kingmetals.com, and today we're gonna go over the differences between hot rolled and cold rolled steel. A cold rolled steel is generally about twice as much as hot rolled steel, and the reason for that is really just the manufacturing processes that each one goes through. Now why would you use one over the other if price wasn't an option? Well, Hot rolled steel, and another reason why it is a little less expensive than cold rolled steel, is it is not completely exact throughout a final piece. If you were to put this under very precise measuring tools, you would see that there are differences. Now there's not a lot of differences to the, the naked eye, but if you were to measure these things, you would find differences. So you, you want to use hot rolled steel uh, when tolerances don't really matter. So if you're doing any kind of uh, general type construction like uh, gates or railings or uh, trailers, anything kind of like that uh, where precise measurements throughout an entire piece don't matter. So that kind of answers our question as to when you would use cold rolled steel. Cold rolled steel you're going to use anytime you, you need everything to be very, very precise. Anything that you're machining or uh, engine products like automotive products, anything like that where you need things to be precise and true all the way through, that's when you're going to use cold rolled steel. Now are there any differences in how you weld hot rolled versus cold rolled? No, not really. The processes are all going to be the same. You don't have to retool or get new wire or new gases. Everything is going to stay the same. Now you might experience some variances in you know how it sounds and how it feels uh, and how your final weld looks depending on the material that you're using, but overall your processes are going to stay the same.